Okay, Jenny. So how did this controversy start? Well, some friends of mine and I were talking, and we thought that it would be fun to make Art Walk a little bit more interesting, include more people, and we wanted to make it a tribute to those shabby, chic French women of the 19th century. So I made an event called French Whores at Art Walk. And the, the event, the, the way that it was worded is I just said that we wanted to dress like French whores for the Art Walk. Um, but, and the only rule was that we blacken out at least one of our front teeth. Um, I tried to include men by saying that it would be fun to have some bearded ladies of the night. And then the, only, and then the game would be that we would just take video clips. Everybody who wanted to could take video clips of all, try to get one of each whore. And then um, also the surprised reactions of the people who weren't in the loop and didn't know what was going on and put them together for a art walk video like we normally have an art walk video. So Cool. So then what happened? Well, I was surprised by the reactions. I mean, the first couple were positive, and then all of a sudden I was bombarded with all of these angry people. <laughs> well, what were the reactions? Well, they were saying that I was encouraging prostitution, and I tried to explain that it was 19th century, you know, prostitutes, so, I, you know, I didn't know how it related, but I did add a second rule. So now the second rule is that you no know, professional whores unless it's a character that you play on stage. So did that help? Not really. Um, they were still angry. Um, I think some people just wanted to be angry. <laughs> but anyway, um, they were just angry and so finally I said, well then, then you know, I didn't want to tarnish Flint's image. And so I added a third rule and that was that you could be a pirate if you wanted to. I even changed the name of the event. Changed it to French Whores at Art Walk or Dress Like a Pirate at Art Walk. So what happened next with the Facebook stuff? Oh, it, it goes on and on. People were so angry. And, and so here's an example of this is exactly what happened. So, as you can see, this is the original event with the addition of Slash Made and Or Dress as a Pirate. Then I included the discussion that followed. Um, I tried to put things in order from top to bottom, but I got it all mixed up. There was so much of it. I changed the names to letters of the alphabet until I ran out of letters, and then I used alphanumeric characters, except for my own name, of course. Um, I thought it was interesting where the conversation kind of ebbed and flowed. Um, it seems to change course with whoever spoke the loudest. It's as if the dissenters were afraid to add their own arguments. Uh, when someone did venture to put a contradictory, um, you know, message in there, a small one, then other people would kind of jump in. Uh, it's kind of interesting. It's just like real life, or on the playground maybe. Maybe adults aren't so different from children when it comes to peer pressure. Um, but, and yet everyone in this discussion is speaking from the safety and security of their own homes, but not anonymously. I wonder where the conversation would have went if none of us knew one another from the real world. See, people from the physical world who know me know that although I tend to be an instigator, I rarely mean any harm. I think of myself as an amuse, which always trying to inspire, get people to do, to follow through, right, wrong, or whatever. But it's fun to read through if you want to read through some of it. In fact, there's even uh, some things I didn't know this before, like uh, references that this is similar to Nazis and the Holocaust. I mean, come on. But anyway, in the end, no one showed up as a French whore. And the only pirate there was me. Okay. You ready? All right. Well, here I am at Art Walk, and as you can see, in the spirit of compromise, I am just chosen to dress as a pirate. And just to make sure there is absolutely no confusion, I made a sign. Good. Okay, and here I am at Buckham.
that's right. I'm a pirate. Hi. She's got a pirate hat and everything. Hey. Can you tell her what the pirates say? What do pirates say? Yar. They do? Yar? <laughs> cool. Have a good evening, pirate. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> and this is Drake Dorman. Is that how that said? Dorman, okay. Jenny, where's your eye patch? Someone said that it might offend people with their eye patch, so I wanted to take it off. What is art? What am I doing? <laughs> 